Hello everybody, welcome back to ESL Drill. In today's video, let's discuss a few interesting words or expressions related to school. And the first one is Kramer, C-R-A-M-M-E-R, -E Kramer. It's actually a special school that prepares people quickly for examinations. Uh, of course, there are many these days. Uh, because of the competitive examinations people have, there are many institutions like this. The second one is honor roll. Honor roll. That's actually a list of best students in a school or college. Not many institutions do this, but there may be. And the third word uh, I want to talk about is recess. You know it. It's a short period of time between lessons in a school when children can go outdoors and play for some time and then come back. And in British English, this is also called break. We naturally say, take a break, have a break. The fourth one is, this is an expression, supply teacher, supply teacher. Strange, this is British English. Now, uh, it is actually a teacher who works at different schools doing the work of other teachers who are ill, uh, who are on courses, I mean, who are studying, uh, course, etc. And in American English, it is called a substitute teacher. I don't know why, but most people who follow British English use this one. Number five is truant. This is actually a student who stays away from school without permission. And there are many these days and teaches how to deal with them carefully. Anyway, there is an expression based on this one that is play truant. It means to be away from school without permission. Your teacher might say this one. If you play truant the next time, you'll be punished. It means if you keep away from school. And the next expression is school governor. Now, this is not from a student. Uh, this is uh, a person who is elected um, and who works with teachers to make decisions about how a school is organized or how an event in school is organized. School governor. And the next one is lollipop lady this is british english and then informal english and meaning is a woman whose job is to help children cross a busy road on their way to and from school by holding up a sign on a stick telling traffic to stop so that the kids can cross the road and of course you can say lollipop man as well if it is a man who does this job i hope you liked uh, the expressions that i have discussed in this video and if you like this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel if you are new here. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.